Hello, Darklings. Hi, everyone. We've got something different for you today. Yes, we're going to be doing a, a head to head on uh, flavours. Two flavours out there. Uh, one of which is extremely popular and uh, has been reviewed by quite a few other yeah, people. Yeah, so, out so there. we're not going to actually review. No. Yeah, what's the use of doing that review? Yeah. Doesn't matter. But there's a contender coming on the scene. And what we're going to be doing is having a look between the two. On the one hand, we have the GVC. Grant's Vanilla Custard. Now, if you can't tell already, I like it. It's nice. Big bubble. Yeah. And a new contender on the scene, which is from Isig Wizard and Mrs. B's Vanilla, Vanilla Custard. Custard. So now there's two flavorings of the same type. Now yeah. the reason why I'm doing this and not like the raspberries and stuff like that is obviously Grant's Vanilla Custard is pretty big. Well known. Um, well known and is raved about. Uh, but it's kind of separate because it's Vanilla, Grant's Vanilla Custard than the normal run of the mill sort of flavors like raspberry, strawberry, yeah. stuff like that. Um, so having a new contender up there it's like Ooh, hmm. Let's try them out. Yep. Let's have a little head to head and yep. see what's what. So, what we're going to be doing is using Mr. Tez here, and they've both been set for. Wait a minute, let me get the. Uh, You've got 306 atties on them. Wait a minute, just that, that's the battery voltage you're looking at there, don't worry about that. So, they're both set at 4, I believe. I'll just check that. 4.1, I need to change that. There we go. It's now set at 4. Yeah. Okay. 4 volts. And the. And an MVP, which is also set for four. So if I go onto that, let's just make sure it's actually going to show four volts. Oh, yeah, you've it, got a quick I think, it, I think obviously that's the number of tokens on it. There you are, set for four volts. So they're both set at four volts. They are both going to be using 306 Bowie's bridgeless with obviously the drip tips, which are like yeah. well, the drip tips. Okay, and so both liquids have been steeping for the same amount of time. Yes, for, they have. For yes, at least so a week. Put the bottles yeah. off, yeah. Um, onto that one. So here we go. Let's have a little taste between the two. Right. Which one do you want to go first? Well, I think we shall do Mrs. B's. The contender. Yes, and we'll put that one on the Tesla. Okay, so Mrs. B's is going on the Tesla. This one here. Uh, we'll, oh, that's actually that's quite soft on that. Oh, squishy ball. So be careful. How many drips? Uh, I put three on. One, two, three. It is an easy bowl. At four volts. Mrs. B's vanilla custard comes in in at 398. And that'll be for 10 mil. 10 mil bowl. Yep. Okay, you can alter the strength. From 6 mil, 12 mil, 18 mil, or 24 mil. That doesn't change the price. For purposes of this, they're all 12 mil, these, these two samples yeah. onto there. Okay, straight away you're getting quite good vanilla flavour on there, um, to be fair. Um, Good vapor production on the mix, even. Um, not really so much on the custard side of it. it, it it's there, uh, but it is not really there, if you know what I mean. It, you know that it is vanilla plus, so the custard part of it is there, but not very strong on that one. That's just starting today's dry, so we'll put some more on that and try and go back to that one in a minute. Okay. Let's try some of the Grants. Now, I must be perfectly honest here, obviously, Grants has been out a little bit longer. And when he's got them in stock, uh, they don't usually stay in stock very long. Um, so, it is one of my favourites, I must admit, at this point. Now, I'm going to have to use a dripper on this, because obviously that's quite a... A big bowl. Put uh, three drops on that. So again, at four volts, and this is the Grant's vanilla custard on the MVP. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we didn't want to put see it 
you know, sort of swap the tips around because there may be some contamination from one to the other. So we decided on two totally separate units at the same at the same voltage though. Not quite as much vapour on that one, but I may have uh, flooded the atty there. Yeah, so you flooded the atty by the sound of that. A stronger taste. Mm. And it does taste like, like the custard now. Between the two, it is there. But the closest I could possibly get to it at the moment, using those two, is full fat milk, semi skimmed gum, semi skimmed milk. Um, it's there, but it hasn't but got the it's not, richness. It's not quite, not quite got the Moorishness. Yeah, the, the the richness for me personally. Those of you who've ever done, ever used skim milk for some stuff, it doesn't work. That's it. Yeah, it was slightly flooded there. It's uh, it's getting better as we go. Taste wise, so let's just do that one again. I've just, I've already dripped. Oh, you've already it. dripped, so that one's ready to go. So again, this is the Mrs. B's. Oh, you didn't do the price of the grants. Where is it? I think he's out of stock at the moment. You just type in there, grants. Well, there it is. Isn't that it there? Grantsvanillacustard.com. Oh, yeah. You can tell he goes there a lot. You just put in GR and it came up instantly. Grants Vanilla Custard. Okay, so we'll put it on a 10 mil, uh, what's it, which what that one is, obviously. And that's uh, £5 for the Grants. So it is more expensive. Yeah. The Grants is more expensive. More expensive. Um, he's out of stock again on Grants as well. Yeah. But if you go all the way up to the 100 mil bottle, it's comparable to the Mrs. B's. Yeah, I mean, I buy them now in, in hundreds. Um, now, it's very important at this point, that whereas they are head to head, this is still very nice. Mrs. B's is still very nice as, as, a, as a vanilla custard. Plenty of production, plenty of the vanilla taste with the, the hint of the custard part of it coming in. Um, but the grants, onto this for me personally, I'm only going to add two on that. It just edges it out of the competition. Yes it does, it, it is a richer taste for me personally. Mm. Um, I do love the smell of this as well. I missed it. <laughs> Give me a bit of tissue. Yes, there we go. Okay. Yeah. Obviously, they're bigger drops from that, so uh, that's affecting the uh, yeah the output. Because I want to keep this as fair as I can for me personally on the taste wise, but. Uh, I think we can say that generally. So sniff that one. Everything these days smells of caramel. Well, it's custard. Yeah, so. yeah. <laughs> now, if they could make one creme brulee, now that would be nice. Just that hint of burnt sugar. Any difference in the, in the smell? Different smell. It is a different smell? Yeah, well, it is a, a nicer different way? Smell. Or no, a... Mrs. B's is a bit more um, sharper. Mrs. So Mrs. B's sharper, Grant's is mellow, a mellow, mellow. smell. Yeah, mellow smell okay. with a caramel. So there you go. That's a, that's a totally different one, a head to head there, from uh, Grant's vanilla custard, and Mrs. B's vanilla custard. Yeah. Uh, Grant's is obviously available from Grant's vanilla custard dot com, <laughs> and Mrs. B's is available from Wizard dot com. Yes, I'll put the the things down the bottom there for yeah. you. Both at twelve mil. Um, Mrs. Both B, nice, Mrs. But, B's but is cheaper for yes. the ten mil bottles, but when you get the the grants, will go up to the hundred mil bottles. Whether e Sig Wizard will do um, discounts if you order 
more than 10 mils. I think you'd have know. to contact them for that. Yeah, yeah. contact them directly. But as I say, none of none of the two are horrible. They're both very nice. But the grants for the what it is, which is custard at the end of it, grants it's, vanilla custard is, is the key word, is a lot richer and a lot more -ish to me. Okay, yeah. That's when you get some in stock. And I know every time it gets it in stock, it's not in stock for very long. So if you want to try it, people, keep your eyes on this site and try and get it. If you want the Sig Wizard one, to have a have a whiz on that one. Have a whiz on that one from the Wizard. <laughs> um, you it's can no contact them possible. direct. Mm -hmm. But yeah, there you go. That's been us, the Vape Miss. You can catch us on Twitter. You can sub to us here to catch all the latest videos coming up. And if you need any help or advice on the videos or indeed anything eSig related, if you nip along to Planet of the Vapes and I'll put the links up again on there. Uh, pop over and say hi because I'm moderator over there and you'll get a much faster response than what you would ask in questions here. Alright people? <laughs> Bye. Have a good day. Bye.